Hello and welcome to gaming and welcome to Fight Night Fridays with Johnny Knoxville on Fight Night Champion. We have created Johnny Knoxville, we've won all the titles in the light heavyweight division and now we have a title defence that has been placed upon us. We're going to try and defend our belts and we are building up towards a rematch with Butterbean. So let's jump into this one. Hey, look, we won an award. Prospect of the year, Johnny Knoxville. Let's look in our thing. Uh, prospect of the year, yeah, we won it in our division. We won uh, Fight of the Year with Brent Turney. We won Round of the Year with Dakota Griffith, which was last week. So go back and watch that video now if you missed it. We got Knockout of the Year. Did pretty well all round. All right, here we go. Thomas and Mack in Vegas. Can we defend these titles or this title? I don't actually know if I'm defending them all or not. I like it when you start fighting. Your stamina is full. I realize that's all I go on about in these videos. It's so important, though, in this game. In blocking like that, there. That's weird. I've never seen a stance like that before. Ooh, just out of range. Now, Etch is fifth in the ranking, so quite a bit further down than some of the other guys that we've been going up against. Obviously, we've gone up against title holders in recent weeks, but a couple of the other title defences that I've had to do have been a little bit higher aid. Already eating some of my stamina up. Well, there's not enough teachers around because if you're a trainer, other than just throwing a towel, oh, he's got punched me. The left hand came in. You're okay, stay with me here. He got rocked. He just got rocked. Tell you what, everyone, still taking punches. I might be going down here. Right now is to grab on a little bit. Stop. Oof. That was close. That was a close one. We got away with that. Undefeated, but didn't the old timers used to say you shouldn't even fight for a world title until you've taken a loss? Yeah, that's right. Because you have to learn to lose to win, and you have to understand that you're mortal. You know, sometimes. I don't know what they're going on about here. Can't help it that we've won every fight. Old timers would say, "Hey, you gotta find out that anybody can get hurt." He's got that big gut punch, hasn't he? Huge. What fighters do pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Teddy, he's so we're losing stamina very quick again. Uh, we have some reason. Well, he's showing that to you right now. I'm looking at him right now, and he's starting last to get fight, up. We, There's a couple we were all right. Left. There's probably five seconds left before he has to Strange. get up. Strange. up early. That shows you right what you're talking about. He can. God, yeah, we're burning through it. I don't understand what's happening. It's a great little step back. I think maybe it's because we got stunned, yeah. That might be why, you know. We've got one through. There's a good step back. We're scoring here. Hey, we'll take a little rest. Well, Teddy score I lost one round. round. But we're yet to get into the meat of the matter of this fight. Him well. Jab with the straight, classic combination. Nice. Good looking up for yeah, catch him here, don't we? What we need. They trade shots. He comes back with a right hand. I'm gonna get caught. See anything? Well, you can 
tell he's being patient, waiting for a nice. opportunity. Teddy, what does he have to think about laying that trap? All he has to do is think a little bit like I do a tax season with my account. <laughs> oh, I thought we got him there. You know, my account is standing at the door. He's waiting for me to Oh, and again. Keeps rebate. avoiding that punch. And that's what he wants. He wants a rebate. He wants a counter. He's stepping back to it, and then he starts coming back with his own. That's a nice little step happened. back again. Oh, he's got me with that good punch again. He could be on the deck in moments. Oh, my goodness. Must have survived this, have we? Come on, man. Get out of there. Get out of there. Good. Good, good, good. It's that one to the body that keeps getting me. That'll be another round to him. Five rounds in. I think we might be in trouble here if we don't get summit soon. Not sure which way this is going to go. I got a right up a cup for once. That's a nice counter. Oh, he's got me with it again. A little gut punch. Survived again, but three times now. Stamina is so low as well. We're only five rounds in. I think it's easy to see why. He's getting hit by that left hand far too much. Well, the most elementary thing, the first thing you're taught in boxing is use your left hand. The second thing, get away from it. Deal with the psychological part. Joe, don't forget, 75% of this game is psychological. Don't let him get discouraged because even though he's not going to say nothing, in his head he's starting to get discouraged. Just say to him, hey, listen, you're going to catch him. And his stomach went way bit. down then. You know what? He's moving his head, so go to the body. Because now you're going to hit him a little enough. You can get away with it if the guy doesn't want to throw back. But if this guy oh, 40 wants seconds to again. Back, bit of a crap round, this one. Not getting away with it. Step right into that punch then. Nice. A couple of counters. Well, I'm under 50% here with his stamina, which is not good with six rounds to go. Of the sixth round. I don't know why it's been burned up so quickly. I would have to go around here without so getting hit and without throwing. Could have gone then, that. Wait, why is he not using any of his stamina? Look, he's using good loads of it. it Punching and stuff, but it's not, it's not going down. Land the uppercut then. And he ties up on the inside. Ooh. He's got no stamina, you know, yeah. That's what we need him to be doing. Burning his stamina up like that. Throwing about four punches here. Hands are booing. Oh, he's done the gut punch. He's got me with it. I might go down. Oh no! Shit! He finally got me. Alright, we're up in three. Finally got me though. So, trying to preserve my stamina has backfired. Now he's got to avoid this opponent like the Black Plague. Bloody stamina so low. And that's the end of round seven. The scorecards are gonna be interesting for this one. You recovered eleven percent. How? You use so much stamina there. How did you recover so much? About thirty-nine percent. We are just winning. I, th I think I'm losing this fight. He has scored a knockdown. Folks would be saying, if it happened once, it can happen again. Get in his ear a little. Come on, Ish. Use your stamina. Back with the left hand again. Use your stamina, up, bud. No! Oh, he he no! I clinched. 
was being completely outworked, but now we see him being more the aggressor. Ball was starting to get a little late. He understood he needed to change Ooh. things a little. It's not going well, this. Oh, he's got me again with the gut punch. Everything was going fine, and then he got caught. Well, that's the problem. It was going too fine. He got a full sense of security. The other guy wasn't thrown back. He took for Jesus granted. Christ. You can't take for granted in this ring. I think we might be losing. Genuinely think it's going to happen. Just got no stamina. He's blowing. Look at Knoxville. Absolutely blowing. We need to score a knockdown out of nowhere, really, don't we? That's what we need. Oof. And round eight comes to an end. There we go. We're recovering a bit now. Long enough and you get a sense at what the scorecards are going to look like. Yeah, we lost a percent. They throw you off a little bit. Starting to get a little discouraged a little bit. Oh, I am. I am massive like I'm worried. He's starting to behave like a guy that's winning. He's staying outside a little more. There we go. There we go, everyone. Let's get back in this fight. Come on. He scores his own knockdown after being knocked down earlier. And that's where scoring a knockdown hurts you sometimes because now you think he's just going to walk in and get it again. Well, he walked in, he did get it. He got it. He gets up after that punch five. down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle. Holding his oh, minute head. 40 to go. Let's try him. There's no change. He's just throwing straight naked punches at him. Let's he try and keep it together. We're up to round nine. We're under a minute to go now. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. Oh, he's got me. He's got me. It's the end of the round, though. We're all right. Knoxville looks confident. I'm not so confident, to be honest. Still got no stamina. Need a scorecard to know where we're at yet, because it could go to points. No! No! I don't know what was said to him in the corner, but now he's the busier man. And he needs to be before any more time. I can't get a clinch. It was so early on in the round. Targets his opponent after blocking a shot. She's gonna go to the wire, everybody. Nice step back counter. There, both fighters got in on him. No. That's a huge left no. Oh, oh no, God. it's all coming to an end. To the once again. He's gotten up before. What about this time? He's gonna put two points on his Three, side. Four, five. There we go, we'll back up. Going after the knockout victory. His man's been down. Now he's trying to make him out. This is a spot, even though you got him. No, he's got me again. Whoa! Holy shit! That was one hell of a combo. Oh my god, that might be done for Knoxville. That might be it, everyone. That might be three points for this round. Come on, I'm up. Oof. You know, this Stamina is killing me. Used to talk about. He used to say, Teddy, when you got two tough guys, well, one's a little smarter. Well, then he becomes twice as tough. Looking good. Able to show you his blocking ability. I can get him at least once. Coming to the end Both struggling stamina-wise, but me a bit more. Oh, we survived. Somehow we survived. We need a scorecard here. I need to know what's going on. I'm up by two. Oof. <laughs> I've just got to survive. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like it. I don't like being in the corner like this. 90 
seconds to go in this 11th round. Got no power in my punches now. Oh, he's going for it, isn't he? Can we survive? 20 seconds. Are we into the last one now? Here we go, last round. It's gonna be so close, this result. Ooh, steady. You can only throw like one punch now and you're just totally out. Remember that gut punch. We blocked it. Just no. Oh, he got a big one in there, though. To be fair. A minute to go. Solid uppercut after taking one. It's going to go to the points. It's going to be close. Punches and punches working well. Ooh. Ten seconds to go in this, the final round. Both knackered. Oh, it's going to be close. One-sided fight. At least that's one-sided one fight. Yeah, I mean, joking in it. If you saw it any other way, you'd have to put a warning out the next time. Did we hold on? Judge your fight, kind of like on a pack of cigarettes. You know, this could be hazardous to your health. I mean, yeah, you could be got away with it. We got away with it. Etch is unlucky there. He had me going. He had me going. What a fight. Let's look at this scorecard. Well, so my early performance won that over for me. But we still hold the titles. Let's see where we are on the rankings. Well, there you have it. We'll see what comes next. I've got a feeling we need to move up a weight division now since we've won all of the belts here in this division. But we will see in next week's episode. If you have enjoyed this one, then please do hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe and see all my videos in your inbox.